pray. Um, I believe it is safe to say that everyone in this room has one point in time come across the microwave or even used a microwave. Here in America, it's almost rare for a household to not have a microwave. According to package facts, frozen food purchases was through the roof and reached an all-time high of $44 billion uh, in sales in 2012. Microwave ovens have become much more a convenient part of everyday life because this world is always moving at a faster pace. Consumers have yet to acknowledge and understand the precautions and dangers of making microwaves their primary method of cooking. My proposition is that microwave ovens have a negative impact on people's health. I will preview the way a microwave works, which will then lead me to my first claim and show you negative impacts, how it has on your food. Lastly, my second claim will provide you with evidence by presenting a study that supports and confirms the high risk of the radiation that microwave, the radiation has on a microwave and has a direct link to increase the formation of your blood cells. The real question is, how does the microwave work? When the water molecules in the frozen food vibrate, heat is produced and the food absorbs the radiation from the microwave. When molecules are shifting around, this creates friction, which then creates heat and warms up your food. Typically, when you microwave your food, your food is being it's being heated from the inside out. Whereas if you do if you microwave or I'm sorry, if you microwave your food, it is being heated from the inside out. The outside in is if you use a stove or an actual oven, which is the proper way. The Global Healing Center states microwave radiation interacts with the molecules. Um, in food. Radiation, as defined by physics terminology, is the electromagnetic wave emitted by the atoms and molecules of radioactive substance as a result of nuclear decay. Radiation causes ionization, which is what occurs when the neutral atom gains or loses electrons. In simpler terms, microwave ovens decay and changes the molecular structure of food in the process of radiation, which leads me to my first claim. Should you be concerned to cook your food in the microwave? The answer is simply yes. Firstly, when using a microwave, it causes more harm than good to you as well as your food. Food exposed to microwaves shows a significant decrease in their nutritional value. I am going to state the most important findings found in a food study conducted by Russian researchers at the Institute of Radio Technology to further support my claim. In every food tested, um, that was microwavable, they found that the natural vitamins and minerals in the food were actually useless. The bioavailability of the vital nutrients, vitamin B complex, vitamin C and E, essential, essential minerals, and lipotropic all decreased in the microwave food. Also, the vital energy fields in all the food tested dropped about 90 or 60 to 90 percent. The digestibility of fruits and vegetables reduced because microwaving food lowers the meta me metabolic behavior and integration process capability of alkaloids, glucosides, galactosides, and nitrosides. Cooking raw meat in the microwave also destroys the nutritional value as it would for any type of other foods such as fruits and vegetables. Um, all of the meat had a decrease in the nucleoprotein. So, to sum this up, all of the food that tested, it damaged every single food. So fruits, fruit, the meat, and vegetables. Which leads me to my second claim. My second claim is that blood cells are, the human blood cells are changed due to microwaves. Now, to support this claim, there was a study produced by food scientist Dr. Hans um, Hertel. Who worked, for, um, who worked for many years for a major food company, which was the Swiss company. Now, Dr. the Global Health Center said that Dr. Hertel was one of the first scientists to conceive and carry out a quality clinical study on the effects of microwave nutrition, nutrition that have on the blood and physiology of the human body. His small but well-controlled study showed the degenerative force produced in microwave ovens and the fruit the food process in them. The scientific conclusions show that microwave, that microwaving, uh, microwave cooking changed the nutrients in the food and changes took place in the participants' blood that could cause deterioration in the human system. 
In intervals of two to five days, the volunteers studied uh, received one of the following foods. Um, raw milk, the same milk conventionally cooked, three pasteurized milk, four, the, raw, the same raw milks cooked in the microwave oven, five, the raw vegetables from an organic farm, six, the same vegetables cooked conventionally, seven, the same vegetables frozen and defrosted in a microwave, and eight, the same vegetables cooked in a microwave oven. Blood samples were taken from each volunteer immediately after drinking the milk and eating the vegetables. From this study, significant changes had been discovered in each of the blood samples from the intervals following the food that had been cooked in the microwave. These changes included a decrease in hemoglobin and cholesterol values, as well as lymphocytes, which are white blood cells. And with your white blood cells, you actually need them. So it was a decrease in your white blood cells. So every time you microwave your food, you have a decrease in your blood cells and the lymphocytes. Uh, Dr. Hertel's study concluded that structures and molecules are torn apart, molecules are forcefully deformed, and thus become impaired in quality. There are no atoms, molecules, or cells of any organic system that is able to withstand such violent, destructive power for any extended period of time. In conclusion, I showed you how microwave oven causes molecules and atoms in food to move around, and by doing so, it loses all the nutrients in food. My proposition stated that microwave ovens negatively impacts one's health. This is because we get our nutrients from our food, with the food that we eat. But the nutrients in the food is what my, that is microwaved are being destroyed from the radiation of the microwave oven. The microwave foods are not only decreased in neutral nutrient values, but it also drastically changes the formation of our blood cells. All right, I'll go quickly. The claim is very clear. The preview is okay, except they're not really phrased as claims. It's like a question and then an answer and then an explanation. I thought that you're really dependent on two pieces of evidence, one on the first point and one on the second point. You do a good job trying to make those two pieces of evidence seem highly credible, but that really seems to be the substance of your argument there. So without you know, any... Um, Ex external support on the argument that it could be problematic, especially, for instance, if the respondent found that additional research failed to confirm the original results, that's going to leave your argument in a weaker position. A lot of reading. You need to be a little bit more talking to us and a little bit less reading. All right. Thank you all for your patience.